What's up guys, this is Merc Music, and I got a mod menu on Black Ops 2 in 2023. Let's check it out. Real quick before we dive into this wacky video, I just want to thank you guys so much for the support on the last Black Ops 2 video. You guys absolutely killed it with the support. So if you guys want to see some more OG Call of Duty stuff, make sure to drop a like. Let's see if we can break 10,000 likes again. What's actually so cool about making these throwback COD videos is it just shows how many like people who haven't watched in a long time come back. But there's also a ton of people who are brand new to Call of Duty, and they don't even know what these games were like. So if you're brand new here, or if you're someone who's an OG and you want to see some more videos like this, then subscribe. And real quick before I show you guys the Black Ops 2 mod menu. I wanted to let you guys know that G Fuel is currently having a BOGO on their tubs for like the next week or so. If you buy one tub, you can get another one free. But even if you don't want to do that, you can still use code Merc and save 20% off. Links in the description below. So here we are, guys. We are on Jiggy Menu V4.2. I do want to be clear and upfront right before we dive into this video. I will not be using this mod menu online. I have no plans to abuse or use this in public matches. This has been my stance for quite some time in Call of Duty, and I still stand by that. Mods can be fun. They can also be terribly unfun. So I'm just going to use the fun stuff in private match where it's not going to hurt or affect anyone else. I'm purely just using this right now for shits and gigs and for my own entertainment and for your guys' entertainment as well, but also kind of for educational purposes because at the end of this video, I will show you guys how you can get the mod menu with the hopes that it will somehow eventually get fixed or patched. This isn't my first time using a mod menu on Call of Duty. I've had it accidentally given to me from infection lobbies. If you guys played back then, you know how prevalent infection lobbies were and how easy it was to get a mod menu just by playing in a lobby with another person who was cheating. But I also want to make it very clear as well. I did not buy an RGH or JTAG Xbox, which allows you to just get these menus right off the bat. The method for getting this mod menu right here is completely free. I don't know why you'd waste your money on it, but yeah. Now that we got all that out of the way, let me show you guys some of the mods you can use. So right off the bat, the way that you access the main menu is you have to aim in and then knife. It pulls up the main mod menu. There are some shortcuts you can access, I think using the D-pad. I think you have to be like crouched or prone. If you're crouched and you click up, it changes your health. If you click right, nothing happens. Down gives you a quick set of cheats. I don't know if you can tell, but God mode, infinite ammo. Look, we don't have to reload anymore. We can't be killed. And it gives us wall hacks and unlimited UAV. Now I can load in some bots. We could try it out on that. Left on D-pad, it pulls up the little map over here and you can teleport yourself wherever you want to. Now, if we go prone, you get access to even more little shortcuts. If you click up on the D-pad while you're prone, it will give you the UAV and wall hacks as well. You can turn it on or off. On the right, it will give you all your ammo, even though we have infinite ammo. If you click down, it gives you legit aim bot, which there is no legit aim bot, but okay. Okay. Absolute oxymoron of a hack right there. We'll turn it off. If you click left on the D-pad, again, it pulls up the map and you can teleport wherever you want to. If you click main mods, these are the ones that people typically use to ruin lobbies, which is so dumb. Talk about god mode, infinite ammo, speed hacks, UAV hacks, wall hacks, going invisible, no clipping and flying around the map. You could also give yourself rapid fire, which is comically fast. The scorpion with rapid fire. Let's check it out. That ain't right. <laughs> they spelled snipers wrong. Glitch weapons. Wait, hold up. <laughs> we can get an iPad? Sure, okay. Unlimited iPad. What about the CSGO knife? Cool. You know what? Let's put some bots on. Why not? All right, so you know you have the mod menu, by the way, because you can run around before the match even starts. Gives you some time to activate your awesome hacks. You can teleport to the enemies. There we go. Wait, what? I didn't have god mode. Uh-oh. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my God. This is what it looks like? This is so dumb. <laughs> you don't have to aim at anyone. Look at that. This is legit aimbot. I don't have to aim. I just have to shoot. Look at that. When they turn green, it means I can kill them. Who would watch this kill cam and be like, oh yeah, that's a legit aimbot. I definitely died fairly to this. You know what? Let's pull up the unfair aimbot. Where is it? Oh, it's aimbots. Here we go. So there's unfair aimbot, legit aimbot, legit aimbot, no aim, TS aimbot, and Azza aimbot. So let's just put on the unfair one. This is what most people use to cheat. All you have to do is aim, and it's just going to infinitely shoot their heads. Oh, I didn't mean to end it. Wow. Some people actually have fun using this type of aimbot online. I just don't get it. I want 75 to 1. You guys have to like and subscribe for that gameplay. Can we get, like, a rapid-fire DSR? Can I use the snipers? Is it actually rapid-fire, though? Okay, I should not have questioned that. It, it won't stop shooting. Please, knock it off. I mean, this is definitely going in my montage. Am I in phase yet? Jesus Christ. This is so dumb, man. But really, one of the best parts of the mod menu is the gangsta mods. We're definitely going to equip the lightsabers. I mean, it looks like lightsabers, but it's just a ballistic knife. Still kind of cool, though. Earthquake. Okay, we just activated an earthquake. Cool. That's not terrifying. Please stop it. We can get a jetpack. Oh, cool. Yo, look at that. Wait a second. Hold A to fly. We can just fly around now with a jetpack. Black Ops 2 has now become Black Ops 3. Look at that. 
We have an exosuit. <laughs> This is so dumb. <laughs> oh my god, it's actually kind of funny though. Now see, if I knew how to host a fun modded lobby online, then I would potentially consider doing it. But I'm new to this. I really don't know what I'm doing. Yeah, sure, let's put it on pro mod. There you go. I can have a pokeball? I want to catch someone. Is it catching them? What's going on? <gasps> it turned them into an AGR. What in the hell? Oh, and... I just randomly got dog kills. Dude, I swear I'm like a 12 year old getting their first mod menu and just like freaking out over it right now. We have a mega airdrop coming in. It's gonna drop a bunch of care packages, oh boy. Can you spawn a windmill? I just, I just spawned a windmill. Look what it's doing, holy shit. <laughs> oh my God. Sure, let's, uh, let's spawn a sky plaza. And that just crashed my game. Yeah, that seems about right. Error, G spawn, no free entities. Whatever that means. As long as we still have the menu and I didn't lose it, then I, we should be good. I'm really afraid it's gonna crash my game and then I'll have to do this whole process over again because from start to finish, it took about 23 minutes to get the mod menu working. Oh yeah, it still works. Okay, we're good. Went a little crazy there, went a little overboard. You can also get some modded weapons too, which is pretty interesting. You can get zombie weapons in multiplayer. The Super Magnum. What's the Super Magnum? Oh. I don't even know who this is killing or how it's killing them. Just, you pull the trigger and like 10 people die. We can get the Thunder Gun. Yo, this is gonna be, wait, the Thunder Gun's the KSG? Uh, how is that gonna work? What in the hell? Ray Gun Mark IV? Sure. It's a ballista. That's definitely not the Ray Gun, but yeah, okay, okay, enough, enough. It's gonna crash the game. I can become the Nuketown sign. That's pretty cool. Yo, we're playing Prop Hunt now. Look at this. Oh my God. <laughs> This just looks so dumb. All right, so this is Black Ops 2 now. It, it just gets worse and worse as we go. This is unbelievable. We got advanced forge mode. Bro, we literally have forge mode in Black Ops 2. Are you kidding me? Look at that. I can make my own things. We can also apparently change maps whenever we want to. I don't know if I have all the DLC maps. Let's see if we can go pot hopping. Dude, the mod menus are ridiculous. I can see why people would use them to have fun, but like the majority of the things you can use on this just completely ruin the game. And really the main reason I'm making this video is to be able to bring more awareness to it. You know, like the people who typically cheat, they're probably just gonna figure out how to use a mod menu on Black Ops 2 and then try to be sneaky about it, try to cheat without getting caught. And if for some weird reason, there are people who are streaming mod menus for Black Ops 2 on Twitch or posting videos about it on YouTube, they typically don't want it to get fixed. I do. And really that goes for all of the old COD games. I just want them to be safe and fun and playable again. And when people have aimbots like this, that's not fun for anyone except for whoever can just pull the trigger and do this. And even then, what's fun about just aiming down sights and then instantly locking onto people from anywhere across the map? This is just cheap and stupid. The only reason I find any of this stuff funny is just because I'm in private match playing against bots. It's not ruining someone's day. I've seen this before on Black Ops 2. Oh my God. We can climb these care packages. Look at that. How big is this thing? No wonder it crashed the game before. Wait. Oh no! Delete all models. It's slowly getting rid of the care packages. They're despawning like trees in Minecraft currently. I want to make a sky plaza, but we need enough space to fit it. Maybe out here in the open will be big enough? All right, no more bots. They're not going to bother us anymore. We need like a big open map. Cove would actually be pretty good. I don't know why I want this specifically to work so well. Wait, is this as far as it goes? I could have sworn it goes higher than this. This is so trippy. Like, where is this going to take us? Where do we go? I I'm here. Am I trapped now? I don't know what I just did. We can get out of here, though. We just gotta teleport. Wait. Where am I? What have I done? <laughs> Put me back in the map! <laughs> Let's try Ice Skater. What does that do? Look how many of these we can spawn. Is my game gonna crash? Look at that. <laughs> what are these things? Definitely don't look like Ice Skaters. They're just spinning cardboard box people? I have no idea. I'm trying to kill them, though. They won't die. Wait, Flyable J! Spawn Jet. There we go. Dude! Okay, that is awesome. This is actually amazing right here. Fire weapon with left trigger. Oh my god, dude. Imagine if we had shit like this in the current Call of Duty game where you could just like play around with a mod menu, but not be able to take it online and ruin people's days. Like that would actually be so much fun. Look at this. Can you imagine just playing with your buddies and fucking flying around these VTOLs and stuff? Crashing into each other, blowing each other up. It'd be so much fun. I'm gonna be honest. If I was a game dev at Treyarch and I had access to something like this, I wouldn't be able to get any work done. Just be goofing around with stuff like this for hours instead of doing my actual job. There we go. I just deleted it. It's gone. Level effects. Wait. Oh my god. Exploding sky? Like, who comes up with this stuff? Lightning bolts? Sure. Spawn the sun. The weather forecast doesn't look too good. We've got missiles. Oh my god. This looks like the apocalypse. It looks like the end of the world right now. You can make it rain dogs. Dog, dog. 
also dog. Dog, 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 and demon dog. It's demon actually dog. raining dogs right now from Call of Duty Ghosts. Rain cars? Sure, why not? Oh my lord, what in the... Sure, let's just rain it all. We might as well just crash the game, come on. It, it's raining everything right now. <laughs> Dude, the frick. I think I broke it. I think I might have just broken my Xbox. So with that being said, thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed watching me use a mod menu on Black Ops 2 in 2023 without ruining anyone else's day. Dude, it's like way too many years late for Treyarch or Activision to really do right by this game and fix the issues and fix this problem. But I hope that by making this video and hopefully if it gets out there, we can somehow save this game. And with that being said, I really do hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did and you want to see some more OG Call of Duty stuff, make sure to drop a like. See you guys later. Outcome. Trinkle. <laughs>